Hey guys, uh, today's project will be putting a little rough on this uh, bay window here. As you can see, we got a, a new metal roof on the house, on the big part of the house, but we thought somebody come up with the idea of putting an accent roof on the bay window, kind of make it stand out a little bit. So my wife did a lot of shopping online and she found this cool real metal. I think you found it. Right? Tin. Okay, I thought you found it. I was looking what you found, I think. Okay, I, yeah, I found it. Alright, anyway, so we found this cool tin design, as you see there, and it was all the copper. It's just like a solid copper color. And my talented wife took a black spray paint and she painted it and then rubbed, hit it with a rag to give it the, what is that, distressed or? Uh, uh, they call, I don't know, on the site, the one that looked like this was like an artisan look, I don't know artisan style to give it that look whatever you call that look and so that's what we're going to put on the bay window roof we don't know if this is going to last yeah <laughs> we, don't, we really don't know but it's just the bay window so we can always replace it if it doesn't last but um it is real metal so. we, yeah we made sure to get an actual metal because we were concerned about like Lowe's or Menards will have the plastic version and if the sun hits it yeah, for the backsplash if the sun hits it the plastic would really buckle probably so we're hoping the metal will hold up just like the roof metal does, but we don't know. So we're going to give it a shot. Um, I think it looks really cool. It'll look cool for a while if it doesn't last, I guess. So, yeah. um, And then we got was able to get a couple of corner pieces, which uh, if you see the roof will have a couple of ridge caps on it. So, all right. We also well, did the back to try to like extra protection for the back too. We just did a you solid. clear just clear coated the yeah, back. Yeah. Well, right? I did the black and then the clear. Oh. Coat. So yeah, we we gave the back a couple extra coats of paint. It was. It was just bare, bare metal, metal on the back, wasn't it? They the actually was... suggested like not putting it on exterior um, unless you like protect the back. Protect side. the back side, just to keep it from getting rusted from the back side. So, um, yeah, I'm pretty excited about this. We'll see how it turns out. And we're gonna take off the well, he is not me. Take off the shingle so the back side doesn't get. Like, oh, you're not helping me. <laughs> oh, that's pretty small area, and I ain't ate lunch yet. So. Oh, she's got another project that we'll have to show you about later. All right, time to get to work. So the first thing I'm going to do is tear these shingles off here, um, just to try to get down to like a smooth surface where I can. I'm going to try to use like a exterior uh, adhesive to glue this stuff down. So I don't want to try to glue it to these. Got all the shingles off now, so um, I think I'm just ready to just glue that right to this OSB and I'm going to glue it down with this uh, Gorilla Glue, the construction adhesive. Um, it's supposed to be all weather and uh, somewhat flexible in case for, to allow for the expansion of the metal as, as it heats up or cools down. So, um, Alright, let's cut some metal and slap it up. <laughs> Okay, that's it for the bay window project here. Um, all done, you're all tacked on there and sealed down. So uh, now we'll just see how it lasts. Um, weather was really nice today. Like literally a week ago, we had negative one and wind chills of like 10 or 15 below here. So uh, today it's 60 degrees and pretty warm out. So 
Ohio weather. Can't beat it. What do you think? Yeah. Okay. Boss approves, so I guess we're good to go. <laughs> All right. As always, uh, thank you guys for watching. I uh, hope you enjoyed this. Um, stay tuned. Like and subscribe for uh, more projects, and uh, you never know what to get into next.